taking flight, never think of consequences. Now, fuck my enemies, now. leave them leaking my intentions. This that hood life. Hood life is what I'm living. This that hood life. Thank you, everyone, for joining us on an- another episode of Two Beans and a Pod. This is episode 11. And today we're going to be talking about um, COVID-19. So, um, yeah, the coronavirus. In <clears throat> particularly, we were initially, we were like, oh, let's talk about like how it's affecting um, everybody and in different dynamics because we have children that are school age, a sixth grader, and then we have adult children that are losing work and then we have information that we're receiving and then we're like trying to figure out what information is true or not and what information we're passing on so there's a lot going on that we're just kind of like hey let's touch on that pretty much yeah and i'm sorry <laughs> ah she got caught she was last week she was talking shit i'm here with my co-host what up what up? <laughs> yeah. Okay. But yeah, so again, you know, uh, this episode is going to be touching basically pretty much on the coronavirus or COVID-19, fucking 5G, whatever that shit is. 5G. You know? Oh, that's but another thing. overall, you know, like, I think it's, a, you know, what I, was, what I was saying to Erica today was that, um, like, we all have our opinions and, like, but facts are facts or, like, exactly what goes down or what happens regardless. You know, and reality is people are dying. Is it the coronavirus? Is it the government? Is it all this other shit? I don't know, you know? But people are dying. People are coming out stating that, you know, it's a, it's a you know, they get sick, and then that's the, you know, they can't breathe right, or fucking... And initially, I was thinking, like, I was even like, do you know anybody? I would call, like, people, like, do you know anybody that has corona? No, right? Do you know anybody that has corona? No, right? Like, so I was kind of like... You know, it's pr- probably not that really that, you serious. know, pr- yeah, not that serious, but we're probably not going to be affected by it, us, you know, so it's like, but then I called the, I talked to the comadre the other day and she had some intermediate family that's actually affected, so I was like, oh shit, okay. And that's, and you still gotta take that with a grain of salt, right? Like, cause what do we know? We're not doctors, right? I mean, people go and they see, like, they're feeling good as fuck, and they say, you know, it's like, oh, you got cancer stage four, you're dying in a week, fucker. So, you know what I mean? I don't know. You know what I mean? Like, but overall, people are dying, and, you know, it is affecting the way we live, the way we socialize, like, everything, you know? And I think that, you know, there are just certain things that, like, I, I just want to stick to, like, facts, you know what I mean? Because I'm all into that whole other shit about... Is it man-made? Or is it not man-made? Or is it 5G network that really is But then if it? you think about it, it's kind of like, oh, what are the facts? Because you're going to... Well, everybody's going to yeah, be like, well, see, that's not a fact. No, but this facts is a are, fact. <laughs> deaths are happening. That's a fact. Okay, that's right? a fact. So mm-hmm. deaths are not happening. So that's for all. It is happening. Mm-hmm. What is it? I don't know. You know what I mean? I can't, I'm not a doctor, so I can't tell you... If it is this disease or it is that disease, all I can tell you is what I'm being told and pretty much by our government, right? Which, again, you got to take whatever they say with a grain of fucking salt anyways. But it is what it is, and at this point, what we understand is it's a coronavirus. Fact two is it's worldwide. It's not just happening in our backyard or in fucking Asia or in Pakistan or in Africa. It's, it's worldwide. So... There's no fucking, you know, is it little kids or is it only adults or, no, it's everybody. You know what I mean? So I think that's fact two. You know what I'm saying? Now, like I was saying, I was just, today was like, this guy was talking and that's where I got it from mainly, you know, where it's like, because we all have our own fucking theories or what we hear or what we believe on the TV or shit, people believe what's going down on Instagram. So, you know what I mean? It's like. Whatever it is overall, you know, it's just um, do your homework, you know, and then get your facts together and then tackle whatever it is. Because your opinion don't mean shit. My opinion don't mean shit. Eric's opinion don't mean shit. My opinion matters. Nobody's opinion matters. (laughs) That's just our opinion. (laughs) You know? (laughs) So, you know, those. I think those are big facts as far as, like, that's what's going down, you know? Now, 
what are we gonna do about it? I don't really know. You know what I mean? I'm, I'm not a doctor. I don't really fuck around. I don't feel sick. My kids don't feel sick. You know what I mean? Like I don't even know. Like you know, I just know. Okay, the social distancing or cover your mouth. You know what I mean? But those are things like you already like I was saying last time, right? I mean, you guys don't wash your hands. No, like, but it's guys, it's more than that. You like, know what I mean? Like I, you know, let's really talk about it. So this is something that's like going on that has never ever happened in our lifetime. Right. Right. Like. Um, so like this, we have to walk around. I'm like, I had to say these, and we had to walk like literally like I'm a homebody. So I really don't get out. So I'm kind of like, Oh, who really cares? You know, but when I do have to get out and they're telling you that you can't get in the store unless you wear one of these, I was like, are you fucking kidding? <laughs> like, I feel like so embarrassed. Like it's covering your face. So it's a good thing. Cause you know, you can't see that I'm like probably blushing or whatever, you know, but like. <laughs> No, for real, it looks, I don't know, it's kind of like, you know, ridiculous. Like, I don't know, like, this is how we're walking around. Everybody, everywhere, you know, everywhere you go, it's like, it, yeah, it's, you know, it's crazy. I thought, though, that didn't the swine flu or one of those things happen when we were younger? I don't know what it was. I don't know if it was when we were younger, but in terms of this, where we're like even covering our faces, that too, no, that no. Oh. where we're like not where know, to so. this. We've never been happened? to this degree, like to where everybody is. I, it's never happened. Not in our lifetime. You know what I mean? Not in our lifetime. I think it's happened like maybe something close to similar in other generations, you know, because of, the plague and all that. yeah, you know what I mean? Like those, the plague and all that homegirl casualty is in the building. Maybe later she'll be like, Oh, show her face. And, you know, sit right here right next to us and chime in, but we'll see. But, um, yeah, as you know, she I'm mentioned she social distance is that way. But, um, but, but yeah. yeah, she mentioned like the plague and stuff. So there's been other stuff in, in, in our lifetime history, you know, but not our, you know, but the U.S. history yeah. where, where stuff like that has happened, of course, but not in our, like, not. I've yeah, never been yeah. through this, you know, uh-huh. and so I was like, initially I was like, but no, seriously, when I have to go now, seriously, it's like signs, like, you have to have a mask in order to come in here, I'm like, whoa, like, Well, like, I was crazy. telling her, even today, fucking, the food from New York, what is it, Como or whatever the fuck, he was saying that anywhere you're at, you gotta put it on, and it's like, he's not asking you, he's fucking telling you, you know what I mean, so it's like. But there's I mean, a couple of places like on the on on the rail. There's a couple of places that like I walked into, where um, um they didn't like I went to the liquor store, you know, salud. <laughs> and um <laughs> and um and I didn't have to wear a mask. And some people are like, oh well, and and talk about it. Like you know, if is whoever's you know tuning in or whatever, this is something that I'm I'm you know thinking that we could talk about because there's some people that are like dumb you know you dumb bitch you're like freaking you, you're putting other people in danger if you're not covering yourself you know what i'm saying right. like there's some people that feel some type of way about me feeling some type of way about having to wear the mask you know what i'm saying like yeah. and and i get it and if that is the case with you um what's up cha cha um and if that is the the case with you then you know chime in let us know like no bitch you know what you're pretty retarded you better fucking wear that mask or whatever it is you know like that's just how i feel you know i i feel stupid i feel i feel really dumb I, I'm wearing I think it. it's, it's like because i i didn't i wasn't with that and it's either. not about feeling stupid but more i, I think it was more like a, um it's better safe than sorry right like that's the way i look at it you know and and more because if this is some real shit say but now we're taking it like however we want right but say this shit really were to blow up because see these are things that um people don't understand. So you know how there was this like spike that was gonna happen, but oh right. we're flatlined and all. Well the reason though, see these are things and I like I was saying Erica that people don't understand. The reason that we're flatlined is because there's nothing, there's no fucking there people are not doing tests. They're actually not even testing because they don't have the equipment to test. So it's not as easy as like, oh go swap your mouth. Put it in a vial, and that's so you know we have a fucking answer. It doesn't work like that, you know? Then they got to go to a lab. The lab has to do it. And, I mean, we're talking about, we're at, like, uh, 200 and something thousand people. You know what I'm saying? So, it's like, that's a lot, right? So, it's like. Yeah, it's they not- were saying this morning, um, I was on, um. On live with uh, Cardi B and um, and <laughs> yeah. Bernie Sanders, 
Um, they were on live. They were on live, and I was watching. I wasn't on live with them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was watching them. <laughs> Damn. I'm just I was, <laughs> I was like, watching them on live, and um, and they were saying that we actually have had more deaths in the U.S. than anywhere um, else, and anywhere in the world, more than Italy, even. And Italy was like um, surpassing us. Yeah. So you know, those are the things that we got to think about, right? Like even the the test. The, the material to get the test done, like cotton swabs, even that's on a shortage. So it's like, damn, you know, things that we didn't realize. Well, I don't know how you guys are, but I know that he knows y'all up in the motherfucker, you know? So I'll go look up shit, and it's like, um, when it first hit, you know, remember we needed essential workers and shit like that? So private companies were buying tests for their people. Like, Oh, you know, I have a, a, a fucking building of 200 people. I need these things to test my people. Well, the government was giving it to them, selling it to them, whatever was going down. However the fuck they deal with that or not. So it's like, well, there's 200 less that they could have gave to the public. You know, and then these people that are, are continuing to, you know, be on the field, whether it's taking care of people or not, they got to get tested before anyone else, right? Because they're going in and out of shit. So it's just like... It's not as easy as everybody thinks. And then, how are we going to get rid of it? Like, straight up, how are we going to get rid of this whole thing? Like, you know, I, I just, I look at this shit all day. I'm like, I do Uber fucking eats and all that. So, I'll be on the fucking radio for hours, you know? So, it's just This like, will be on everything. Like, he's on freaking YouTube looking up shit. He's like on CNN. He's like on, I mean, he's on everything. He's on it. <laughs> and then he comes over here and then he like gives me like, certain information and then I'm like I'm filtering like mm, I'm not gonna I think that I call BS on that for example homeboy he freaking calls me and he's Some like Erica bullshit, okay? this, uh, that's what I thought too but he was serious but he was I serious was. and he was like Erica fool <clears throat> you say cause I keep saying just relax you know what I'm saying like I'm, I don't wanna be all like you know ex- excited yeah. about it you know like we'll cross that bridge when we get there type of deal right and so, you know, he calls me, he's like, Erica, I told you, I'm told, I told you shit's fucking getting real. And I'm like, what's up? You know, like, and he's like, fucking, um, in, in, in Russia, this in is Russia, time bring this up, just in Russia, you because this is live. You guys got to see this fucking shit live. The other one was just recorded on pod, on the pod bean and you could just hear it in case you didn't hear it before. Now you're watching it, you know, the story. But anyways, trying to kill the story and fucking, he fucking, so he goes, um, in Just Russia, like they're letting on. they're letting go of 500 lions to make sure out in the public to make sure that people stay in their homes. <laughs> Shit is getting <laughs> real, like, and I stayed <laughs> quiet. I stayed quiet for a minute because I was like, "Is he serious?" I was like, wait, is he serious? Like, wait a minute. And I was like, I'm waiting for him to be like, oh, just kidding or something. I was like, hmm, how do I say this like nicely? Like, Hell no. Nah, I don't think so, you know? <laughs> so, it was believable though, right? No. <laughs> no. Nah, honestly, <laughs> honestly, I was like, fuck, you, hey, you never know. Putin's crazy as a motherfucker, you know what I mean? Like, he don't give a fuck about his people. He gives a fuck about his country. That's it. You're done. What up, what up, Negro? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So it's like, thank you for tuning in, fool. I know you're over there in Mexico chilling. Thank you, gracias. <laughs> but fucking um yeah up, so you know how as a matter of fact Negro how is it over there bro? Oh uh, we got my primo tuning in you know on Facebook from Me- Mexico. Like Me- how is how is that Mexico. shit over there in Mexico as far as like the virus and shit? Let's if you can you know says. type up some shit, let us know so we can like say what's up. You know what I mean? Stay in quarantine too, but they Are you guys being quarantined over there, primo? Let's see. Maybe he'll like tune in right now and like answer that. But that's that's. That's a, a good question, you know, like how how heavy is it in Mexico? Is it They're the same thing? The are they were like wearing like the masks and stuff too? They are, like no, not. the cases out there is really A ver qué dice el primo. A ver if el primo le contesta. But But yeah, you know, I mean those are the things that I think that He said it fucking sucks. It fucking sucks. Wow. Well yeah, but like are you guys wearing masks and stuff? Like let us know. Yeah, so you know what I mean? I think that it's I don't think anyone's taking it serious. Like, I see the freeways because I be driving more. That's just getting filled more and more. Then you got fucking um, our governor talking about he's thinking about trying to reopen maybe soon. And it's like, 
okay, like what the fuck, you know? So that's what I don't know. You know what I mean? Like, like maybe a couple of weeks. You know? I don't know. But like this some is people the thing. feel like nah, fuck that. Like till the end of the summer. <laughs> like. But see, this is a, this is a, a good thing that they were bringing up. Okay, so say we open, right? Um, what do you think is the next essential thing to open? Because you can't just boom fucking open up. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, what do you pick? The nail hair shops. Mark. I wait. The nail <laughs> hair shops. <laughs> Visa la homegirl casualty. But um, I don't know. Like because you know what? So let's talk about that too. Like what's the things that are changing and things like that. So oh. because of what's going on, um, what is es- essential is kind of oh. like changing. I think you know, like in how we view what essential is, right? right. So um, like um, somebody else might have thought that you know the kids going to school. Um, yeah. was essential, you know what I'm saying? And actually, like, at this point, like, I'm, like, I'm down with um, my son being um, remotely um, being taught. He was today in math class, you know, from two to three, and it was, like, it was dope, and he could, you know, go on and for another hour after if he wanted to, which he chose to, which is, but, you know, it's kind of, like, you kind of lead, leading them up to them, and they're being independent, so I don't know, like, I, kinda, I don't know about the kids. Everything the that's kids, going on that is one. is changing, you know, how you view things, in, in, including, like, materialistic stuff, right? So those motherfuckers that were, like, um, what? Let me see those things right now. Oh, those motherfuckers that were, like, um. Do you got to wear these motherfucking things like this one? I mean, like, yeah. because <laughs> he just says it's pretty ugly, so. Yeah, so. But yeah, so the dynamics are changing because you know because of people because of what we're doing. So what we we might have thought was essential the prior to this is probably not so essential now, right? Like materialistic shit, for example, right? Yeah, but so, so that's what I'm saying though. Like, like the the you know what is brand what? stores are not going to open and people are shopping online. Like, but you know what, what I mean? is so, essential? Like that's what I'm asking you. What is it? What do you think is something? You know, like what's I think what you think? what's Just open something. now is essential. No, but what if some, if, if food they were to open up if food tomorrow, market gas if they were to tell you tomorrow okay we're gonna open up one more thing or two more things you know starting next week what else is essential because I mean you have pretty much everything I don't know no oh here they are fucking dying. Casualty, the homegirl casualty needs to come in and sit down with us because she's behind the screens just talking. Um, oh, what's up, Creeper? He says, Venny's for our shows. That's what's up, for reals. Like, that's the, no, no kidding. Like, what the fuck? I'm yes, over here is. thinking. He's saying he don't, they don't wear that. They're not wearing these over there in Mexico. Oh. They are, but not as much because the cases up there is less than 100. He said, the, the, the primo, he said, no, not really. People are not Sorry. wearing masks. Oh, okay. Oh, that's what's up. So they're not, I guess they don't have to wear masks out there. But yeah, so yeah, venues, I think that's a, ne- a good thing. Venues? Like, shows, no? No. No. That's what the worst thing. Hell? Like, this gallery. He's a fucking hater, that's why. He's a fucking hater, that's why. No. He's always hated on my they shows. Say, they no. say it don't even count on one type of fucking event happening to 2020, I mean, 21. Like, Ahí está Creeper. Ya te tiraron la sal, güey. No, I'm just saying. No, I'm just saying. You know what I mean? Like, serio, like, what is it? You know what I mean? What do you guys think? I'm like, what is something that it should be open? You know what I mean? Like, I don't know. You know what I mean? Like, what? what? I, don't know, I, don't, I can't even question. think of shit. I don't shit. even think. I think that's what I said. I think that everything that is essential is like, it's open, already open currently. Yeah. So how do you restart so the fucking economy? So we can do... We can do with everything that we're <laughs> a purge. I'm sorry. I don't know. So you know what I mean? Like those are the things that think in steps. And not only that, but are we gonna have a fucking vaccine? Okay. You know what I'm saying? Not only a vaccine, okay, say we're not even gonna have a vaccine. Okay. How about we fucking do um uh, uh, a treatment? You know, that's what a guy was yeah, saying. Yeah, I don't, I don't know if I feel a vaccine. Until there, there's a vaccine or some type of treatment, um, nothing's really going to happen. Nothing. You know what I'm saying? Nothing's going to pop off. Ain't nobody going to open up no fucking strip clubs for y'all. Like, none of that shit's going down. You know what I'm saying? So, I think that even after certain shit opens, people don't want to go do that shit. I mean, Erica's grandma, I'm like, don't even want to go to the corner. 
You know what I'm saying? So it's like, hey, you know what I mean? Like, so much I've been saying that this has like, the potential to change the dynamic of everyday living, like, for, a, like, a while, you know, like, permanently, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. you know, the way the kids go to school, you know what I mean? The way, you know, who actually works, you know, they've been, and then low-key, it's like, you think about it, it's like, kind of like, oh, shit, they've been pre- prepping society for something like this, and that's why everything has been going, like, remote, you know, like, you know, remote people answering your the phone calls at the call center and stuff like that, people from other countries and stuff like that, you know, because oh. it's, this has been prepped, you know, like, in the works or whatnot, but I don't know. I don't know. I think it's too much bullshit. I don't you know. I suppose, you know, like I said, just overall, a, a virus or not, something's up in this motherfucker. So how are we dealing Somebody's with it? Somebody's fucked up, you know what I mean? So how are we dealing with it? How are you guys dealing with it? You know, um, how, well, how we're dealing with it over here, um, freaking, we have a, a, a son who's in sixth grade, and um, he... Um, he is going to school online so remotely um and he just we just figured out like how to go on so that he can actually like the webcam stuff to Uh use the webcam and do all that and then um i had a a, we had a we have a a 27 year old who was working um at the car dealer and um he actually ended up losing his job because of the whole thing and they ended up giving him uh, like a, a letter with his um, with the letter saying that he was laid off they gave him like a letter for him to take over to, to for the unemployment office and I guess that like they're giving like extra payment kind of like those stimulus checks mm-hmm. yeah and what about those stimulus checks who's gotten them like who's gotten them who's gotten them <laughs> yeah but, I don't um, know yeah, I mean I think like um I think it's too 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 short to like say this is what we need to do or not because I don't know shit. I still don't have an answer of anything. Like I don't trust shit. I'm not getting a fucking vaccine. I'm telling you right now. I don't give a fuck. I don't know about vaccine that. Vaccine ain't gonna happen. You know what I'm saying? I don't even fuck around with fucking needles. So it ain't happening and ain't gonna you know, and as far as a treatment, like what type of what type of treatment are you gonna get? Because that means you're you're only treating the actual, <clears throat> you're treating it. You're not curing it. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? So, mm-hmm. like, I don't know, man. I I, I just want to see what, you know, because this is the reason I say it more, because I kept saying, you know, it's Erica, because that's what I mainly tell you, you know? Oh, this is going to happen. Erica, Erica. You know? <laughs> and she's like, nah, fool, you tripping. All right, fool. I, I don't, this you guy know? always says that I'm nah. like. And, and, and look, and the reason I say that, she, she look at, look, that I'm glad that we are on live. Like, so you can see our faces, too. So, whether you're saying, I don't know, or whether you're saying, um, maybe, um, or I'll wait till when it comes, that's still saying you don't believe what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying? I don't care. No, I'm saying I'm not tripping off of it. I exactly say these words. That's probably so. It could be. No. It has the potential. No. I'm not saying I, I say these exact That's words, but I don't care because it's not affecting me and my life right now. And it's not, you know what I mean? Or, I I, or, or it, yeah, I'm not, it's not affecting me and my life right now. Right. And we'll cross that bridge when I get there, because I understand that there is potential. I just said there's potential for this to change the whole everyday life. You know what I'm saying? Like, so you know what I mean? Like, I'm not, like, ignorant or freaking being oblivious to to everything and what's going on in reality of it. But just when he calls me and he says there's going to be 500 lions, and then he goes, like, and then he's like, oh, oh, watch, oh, revolution. You know, and I'm like, damn, fool, why are you so happy about this, like, revolution? You know, that was two. That was two. That was two. And then, you know, I know, but... One but you know, so I'm kind of like I, that's Watch where I'm like that's that where one. I'm like well I don't know you know and he's like oh and then he calls me he goes I told you and I'm like I told you what no, bro no, like I told you <laughs> so you know like it, the the way I, the way I say the, what I'm trying to say overall and regardless of what is because grab some more tea or ice taking yourself. taking the whole like I'll deal with it when it comes it's like well then you ain't ready. You know what I'm saying? Because we all sit here and we're all like, oh, I'm ready for anything. Well, you actually ain't. 
You know what I mean? So you can sit there and I tell her the same thing. You can sit there. I'm not there, trying to act like I'm you ready. Know, like, I'm just uh, saying. You like, can sit there and be like, um, I'll deal with it when it comes. Yeah, because I deal or, with a lot of stuff in my life like that. And that's or, just my character, you know? And I understand that, you you know, you're different. It's just, you know what I mean? Like, the my only thing of saying that is just like, we're just different, you know? So when he's like, oh, I told you so. And you were like, nah. I'm like, I, I didn't say nah. I was just like okay, like, I'm not worried about it right now, you know, like, that's all I'm I'm saying, you know? But, so, you know, like I said, even with, like, the school thing right now, right? So, from what I understand, I heard my son last time saying something like, that they're gonna make fools, like, take the year over? The mm-hmm. fuck? The whole school year. Are you fucking year. kidding me? Mm-hmm. The whole school year. You get what I'm saying? So, it's like, all right, keep, t- keep being like, ain't nothing happening. That's exactly what they said when the when I was like the schools are gonna shut down. Watch, ah, fool, they shut down. They're gonna shut down for like two weeks. Okay, a month came. Oh no, another month. You know? Oh, initially oh, I was came? like, no. Nope. And yeah. now what? Nice initially I was like, oh freaking, they're gonna they're gonna close until like after spring break. You know, like but and then I was like, oh, till like right before spring break, they were like, oh, till May, and I was like, oh, it's possibly till the end of the year because May. May 28th in Pasadena, at, at least, is the, the last day of the school year or something like that, you know, but, so I was like, ah, uh, you know, like, they're just gonna push it all the way through, they just went on vacation early, you know what I mean, they got freaking, um, nope. days off, and, and vacation days, and sick days that they need to use anyways, you know? Oh, yeah, okay. <laughs> you know I guess I mean? not, that's not the case, and I'm aware of that, don't think that I'm being, like... You know, blind to the fact that I'm aware that that's not the case. <laughs> yeah, you know, it, it, it was always a whole thing, right? Like, they were telling, the, I was thinking, like, man, why the fuck do they have us on one month? And then next thing you know, the next, they're telling you the next month. Well, if you really think about it, right, it's like, if they would have fucking told us at one point, you know what I'm saying? Fucking, um, <laughs> at one, at one madrazo, <laughs> hey, you motherfuckers, we're shutting down for four months. Motherfuckers would have lost their mind, I think, you know? Scoot over. Casualty's so, going to join us. So it does make sense, right? It's kind of like some poly shit right there. <laughs> Scoot well, over. Scoot over. Casualty's going to join us. So. You sit in the middle. I'll sit there. Are you sure? Yeah. So that's what I'm saying, right? Okay, it's I'm like. <laughs> I, people, I think, take it too lightly. I mean, as far as we could to make sure that. Bye, Wayne. People take it too lightly. <laughs> People don't believe it. Do whatever you want. I just this is a crazy thing, right? Because like Casualty was saying, you know, I got my gas mask, bro. Right there. So About two say years say ago, <laughs> I started buying a bunch of different gas masks. Me just because I like cycling around, you know what I mean? So I was buying a bunch of them, you know, and I was like, I was like the third one, and I'm like, do I really need another one? Yup, yep, I need another one. You know, and if you, you think about it, like the whole thing right now, it's like trippy, right? Because it's me, Erica, and our two boys. You know, our older ones are already doing their own thing, you know? So it's funny, right? It's like, what the fuck? Is that a coincidence that I have four actual masks that I actually need maybe at some point? That's just what I'm saying, you know what I mean? Another like, thing that they're taking over is uh, they're buying a lot of guns, ammo. So another thing that they should open is definitely the gun shop. That's what's oh. it. That's another essential. Are I they think. closed? They're all closed. Oh. Yeah. A lot of people started buying a lot of ammunition, guns, anything they could get have their hand, their hands off because they're like scared that I was an attack is gonna be coming in I was and everything. Like, All the yeah, guerrillas. We don't have that combo, but yeah. <laughs> Combos we had something and I got rid of it. And I was like, don't so get rid of like, it. Do you understand? It's, the revolution might be like around the All corner. of a sudden, right? <laughs> like, like that's what I'm saying. I'm, that's what I'm saying. He doesn't understand. I'm not making fun of the revolution. I'm saying there's a potential, but I'm not going to be stressed about it. I'm not going to be acting like, oh, shit. Oh, my God. Or be worried about it or be putting fear about a revolution in people's brains and in people's thoughts and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? If... You know what I'm saying? We're not there right now. You know what I'm saying? That's all I'm saying. We're pretty much But over. make sure but if you're there is a, prepared. If there is a I'm prepared. What's the revolution going to be about? What are, what are we fighting for exactly? What revolution is it? Uh, like for a change. Like, change of what? What? What, what not? Um, fucking actual freedom. <laughs> not just fake freedom. You know it's what I mean? It's never going to really be freedom because you always got to live by um, laws. Anarchism is like not, a Not, not only consumer. freedom, but the way fucking you, you like see a person because regardless of what, regardless... I know that we, 
we might experience some type of little racism here and there, but we don't have it like black people. I don't care what anyone says. You know what I mean? You don't fucking get looked at. You don't fucking get like... And regardless of their circumstance, regardless of, yeah, they might be there. Yes, they might be smoking crack, but we do too, right? And we still... We are still... we. I don't think Mexicanos have felt... Um, just on it, because I'm Mexican, you know what I mean? But I'm, I know there's other people, and I know there's a lot of us. But I'm saying overall, Mexicanos cannot ever say they felt the same type of racism that a black person has felt in any way, shape, or form. I'm like, I don't know. Yeah. Like, no, how, how? I don't know, because, because, because okay. another podcast, yeah, I'm like, I don't okay. know. I how? think, I think, I think, okay, maybe it's not the same, type, 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 Mm-hmm. Huh? Maybe as a group, you're saying, or we're like, still a minority. Yeah, maybe as a as a group. I don't know, but like, I think that I don't know. I don't know. That's I don't know. I, and you know what? That's not even something I want to touch I on. Think they, <laughs> Actually, I think yeah, it's gonna like, be touchy. But you know what? It's kind of like it's one of those things that <laughs> if I, you don't know the facts, and I don't really know the facts of it, you know, to be like be able to have an opinion and that that opinion if i had an opinion on it that my opinion on that matter doesn't matter so why even really give it like especially when i'm not i think we have felt you know it because well you know what they get more the... benefits than the natural mexicano it's statistics it's if you actually research and everything and i'm not being racial not being, i'm just saying statistics like textbook statistics you go in there and everything and they will give that person uh uh you know african american um, the more the opportunity that job or anything um, uh, and except for a mexican why because he's in the and you know doesn't have the papers or whatever even though that person is more uh has more the skills for the job and everything than this fucking person you know what i mean and uh, it's not a racial thing or nothing but yeah we have felt that prejudice and thing like that and everything and if you're talking about a revolution freedom to what well, well what is the freedom if we're all still gonna be bound to these strict rules and everything especially with trump and power and everything so either way uh you know like i mean th- there's a big example the whole wall building and everything well, and we're not feeling that we're not being prejudiced ag- being prejudiced against us like as Rasa, of course we felt it. Yeah, we felt it, but we don't make it as being built. Yeah, but we don't. We don't. But the facts. Simple, simple as, simple as this, we don't make a big ass deal about it. We try to make it more civil than other posts and everything. And you know what? It's pretty fucked up, you know. And like I said, you know, I'm a cool. I'm not racial. I'm not being you know biased about anything or anything. But if you really, really want to get into some shit, look at the news and everything. Black lives matter. This and that. And everything, but do you see Rasa matters? Do you see this and that? You know what I mean? And, and I, it might sound fucked up, not, but I don't mean it in any racial that's way. That's our fault, actually. That's not nobody else's fault. Because you know, because organized. our com- community doesn't go out but, and do that. You know, because we're not organized. More black people each other, get killed than we get killed. Chinos stick together. White people mm-hmm. stick together. More what? But Rasa, we more black people, people get shot than Latinos get shot. So it's like those are the reasons. Those are the reasons that, regardless of what, like and and. I'm, that's what I'm saying. It's based on opinion. Thing, you know? know what I'm saying? It's like kind of like it, it, that's uh, not really based on opinion. Those that's are an facts. Opinion. No, that your black opinion people that get killed more. No, that's by a, a fact. Cop. That's a fact. But your opinion that um that they're that being more they, prejudiced they're, against yeah they're they people they're more that prejudiced they have against been have against. been have gone through more stuff so as or, a peoples. They've gone through more suffrage than any other peoples. Yeah. You know what I mean? Is pretty much what you were saying. Yeah, and that's a fact. And I, that's an opinion. How was that? That's an opinion. Can somebody tell me? Um, like, Yessie, what? hi, Yessie. <laughs> Yessie, is that an opinion or a fact if you're still on? <laughs> um, that, you know, that um, the black community as a peoples have as had, a as a peoples, yeah, have had more, you know, suffrage than any other community as a whole because and that, that was and that, that's a fact the Indian, the Thayano, he's that, not you know? and you're not talking about in US right you're talking about as a whole yes worldwide worldwide the black community yes. that's what he's saying I'm like, okay, so I, I'm going to wait for somebody, hopefully, to have something to say. I think that's an opinion. That's not right now. I think that's an opinion. I think that's why that's why we should actually, just, you know, the black and uh, black and brown together. Yeah. That's yeah, a revolution. Yeah, instead of, yes, fight the man, you know I know love I mean? that. Yeah, that's instead of, like, the comparing. Man, instead of just who, who got, who got um, spat on more, who got stabbed no, on more. No, like, yeah, It's no. like, it should, that put be put aside and actually, like, like hey, let's together let's and actually fight. together, yeah, and against the, the white yeah. man. Yeah. Yeah. Look, I the reason talk about is, that. the whole point yeah, of it, because I don't want to, I don't want to continue on the whole race shit, you know. Yeah. But point of it is, it's a touchy subject. What, what I want to, what I like, 
overall the thing about why I want a re revolution because through revolution there's change. Whether it's a good or a bad, change is gonna happen. Do you know what I'm saying? Only through war and bloodshed and people dying and, and like for whatever cause they believe in, shit is gonna change. People yes, are actually said, gonna they still got privilege. They still got what? Privilege. Privilege. Mm -hmm. But and it's I feel like, like I said, it's not a racial thing. It's you know, like, who's they get, better they than got, who they got privileges like in what though specifically? Like jobs, like opportunities. Well, yeah, like, but we so you gotta we think about it. That. You can't, but you gotta realize you are illegally here. But that's what we're saying. You're talking about freedom, real freedom, and that's what you want a revolution for. But then you're okay that because we're illegally here, we can't work. You, yeah, but it's even a law. though we're better qualified. It's in but the that's law. not a real freedom then. But it's not in a, the law. That's not a real freedom then. So Why what? Not? What is the revolution Abide that you're talking about for and then you'll have it. So then, what do you want the revolution for then? I just told you. If it's not for something like that, for freedom. But what if kind our of freedom? people's freedom, right? Like, then what type of freedom do you do you are you so excited about this possible revolution that this could bring? I just said for change. What kind of change? If any it's not for our peoples. For right now, any change is better than what we're at now. I think any the change, change. Of, of unity would be would be fucking any change. You know, because good. like um, for example, uh. Well, no, you know what? Mm -hmm. I'm not even going to continue on this shit. We're on some whole other fucking right. thing. Oh, and uh, then, yes, he goes, I was answering DJ Creeper. I was like, oh, oh my oh. bad. <laughs> <laughs> She's on the line. Hi, everybody. What's cracking? Shout out to Thanks everybody that's on the live right now. Thanks for tuning in. I'm here to, like, I'm the Miss Yango. Know, you know? <laughs> I don't know which, 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 which is which, but saludos <laughs> and everything. So, yeah. Creeper's like, I got you, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> She's all yelling at for a fucking Yessie in there. Then there's two over here. It's like, come on, man. <laughs> this guy. I don't know. I don't know where he's what. Nah, but overall, like I said, you know, this shit's real. You know, I don't think we should take it lightly. I don't think we should be like, you know, and like, it goes back to um, when we're on the episode about um, education, higher learning, right? Well, why don't we have information? Because I bet you there's not a... There's... Very far, maybe even few um, Latinos, Mexicanos, Panameños, Argentinos, whatever it is, those doctors are not the ones right now in the back, you know, testing. They're not in the ones, they're not in the front. Well, the front line, maybe they are like at the hospitals. But well, what about you know, the, the doctors like, in the boats? There's you know, a lot of people that donating their time and their, um, their, uh, well, shout out to all the doctors in it too. What you yeah. call it? That is going in the boats. I mean, there's all sorts of people that are. You know, sticking together and trying to. No, but I'm saying like the it. actual people, like for example, I was saying like, like there's a task force, right? Task force. None of those people on that task force are Latino or Black. So how are we gonna get this information to our people? Or like, if there's nobody in that field, right? Like when that, that's what we we're talking about the higher learning last time, where it's like, nah, fuck that. You know, do you gotta go to college? Do you gotta do this? Yes, because. Then if there was a badass fucking Latino that knew some shit, they're going to pull that fool. Come here. I need to know this. What's he going to do? His job then to relay it to us. You know what I'm saying? But we're, all we're hearing right now is hearsay or what we see on TV or on the video or internet. Well, I got, I got like people that. in the nursing in the nursing community. So shout out to all the nurses out there too, um, especially to my homegirl Jessica. Um, but you know that they're all covered mm -hmm. up and they're like right there working and everything. So we do, we do got some inside thing, but we're just not really about the cheese net right now. They're just like kind of there trying to help and everything. And it's just like, you know, not to add on to the more, com like, you know, uh, con to contribute more to the conversation as in like, um, you know, Latinos not, uh, having all the information. We do have it, but right now we're just focusing on, on getting the well being of others. You know what I'm saying? Like, but, those, that there the, is there, but that the there people is that's on the front line, they're not doctors. Do you know what I mean? So they're only being told by the RN, by whoever's on top of them, you know what I'm saying, what really goes down. And then, even like you just said, right, earlier, they'll probably give a black guy the job or, or a female black woman, you know what I'm saying, the holla before us. What I'm trying to say is we don't, we don't have, we don't have, we don't, we do not have presidents, we don't have, um, fucking like you know even to just now right even some of these governors some of these fucking representatives that are even in the you know up in government like 
They're barely now, we're barely seeing our people up there. Like our actual people. Blacks have always been up there. But name me a governor or like... Uh, uh, that proves that they have... That, yeah, uh, they got poor. You know, or, or, or like somebody over huge. Like in, the, in the racial thing. Though. Yeah. Over us. You know what I'm saying? We don't. You know what I'm saying? So that's just what I'm saying. I think we should... All unite and be happy. Yeah, like, well, <laughs> that too, but... You know, I think that yeah. in order for us to, to really have real information, you know, we have to have our people in those jobs, doing those jobs, you know, because um, right now we're just going on hearsay, regardless of what, you know what I mean? And, our, and, and, and they probably are, like Catherine, you just said, well, since it's, it's going around world, since it's going on worldwide, yeah. I don't think we're misinformed. If it was just like a... A we U.S. Don't get Mexico news here, though. You just did. I know. Primo. I yeah, know, but, but yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, and then, what does he know? Really? Like, other than they don't. What does he know, there? primo? Did you hear no, him? No, he no, said, "What does he know?" Like, like, what the fuck? What do you mean? What does he know? He's no, in Mexico, he, yeah. but, so no, he knows I mean, a lot more than you. You know. No, but, but I'm saying there's there's a lot of us. There's a lot of us. There's a lot of us that do have communication with our fa- familias in Mexico. That's a fact. The news, the you know news what I'm saying? That's a fact. From there so you them. get, and then so, yeah, and then so even if you're like watching Univision and you're trying to act like you're getting <laughs> your information or your news from Univision or something like that, that and might not yeah. be the case because, you know, like his mama calls Mexico every fucking day. So, you know, even if Univision is, that's so even, that that's shit? not racist. I'm that's saying, so racist. even <laughs> if it's Univision, <laughs> Even if it's like fucking Univision where you think that you're getting your news from, people are still calling their families and getting information like real from their families. Yeah, That's I don't believe the beyond the believe, freaking, you know, regular media. Here. You know what I mean? Yeah. So, the we most know. corrupted people. So, we know what's like going Mexico's on. Like, are corrupt. So, you're calling your yeah. people corrupt? Then. Yeah, he's corrupt what? as fuck, too. Because he's saying other people. Are, all the people in Mexico are corrupt. That's what he's saying. Like, the government, they're corrupt. No, but I'm saying but you, the, people the people are calling people. their families. Yeah. To get information people, from their families, like the people like your I'm tia, seeing. like your mom calls your tia, and and we call you know your mom calls you know what I'm saying out there. Yeah, my mom, my it. grandma calls her her cousin out there, and oh, que está pasando okay. over there, prima? So me, oh, you know, don't worry example. about the news. Kind of like when they the call. Angle, excuse me, the excuse news. me. Kind of like when they call over here and they're like asking us, right? Like, hey, ¿y qué está pasando allá en los Estados Unidos? Like, what's going on? Oh, well, you know what? This is what's really going on because on the news, they're showing, like, all this and that, right? Like, it's a... But you know what? They're getting firsthand, real life, like, of what's really going on. So, in terms of this this situation here, I don't think that we're being uh, misinformed, um, ill-informed, or lack information um, in terms of a community. You know but what I'm saying? But it is like, exaggerated a lot of things that they mm-hmm, say because, mm-hmm. you know, I mean, it's primer impacto. What, 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 do, what do channels in Spanish do? Novelas, right? It's dramatic, over-dramatizing. It's just like everything's over-dramatizing in the news and everything. Why? Because it's publicity. Because that's how they make their money. Because that's how, you know, why to get people scared and everything. But they're not really, really, really focusing on what's really going on inside the government and the government works and everything. Because everybody's all so scared about all the COVID and everything, which I know, yes, it's good to get to see a rich kid and it sucks that, you know, United States is the most infected in the world and shit. This no, the United know States. What eating. We're this the one. What she's um, eating. <laughs> in case you want to know. Yeah, so. <laughs> like, I'm, I'm just saying, saying you know? if we're taking this serious, right? Mexico should be taking it serious, right? But my primo just told us that they're not even wearing masks. They're wearing masks. Because they're, like, not wear, they're not infected no, like, they're us. like us. Correct. We're more infected matter. than Italy, so it hell yeah, fucking matter. wear the mask like it's, that. It, if it's, so it, then we should have wore the mask from jump like that then. You know what I'm saying? Like, and we did it. But a lot know? of the things in Mexico also, too, is not... Filled with a lot of the shit is not filled with chemicals. It's not killed with the uh, substitutes. It's not killed like that. Just in, like just in, as an example, milk. You know what I mean? This is as much milk that you get. Everything else is just uh, all the vitamins and water and uh, preservatives. Uh, preservatives. It's all bullshit and shit. You know what I mean? Like that. That's just you know take note and everything. Like that's like, like, like the that, news. That's yeah, how the news like, is and yeah. everything that you get. Like, it's, it's a really like healthy. Much, it's it's like, not. I'm saying it's not a really healthy uh, um, country and shit, but. It has this much compared to this much percentage in how we have uh, of infections in the United States. Like it's just like it's it's fucking crazy, you know, and because we're overpopulated. 
that's what it is over there. It's just, you know, kind of more uh, level. It depends on where you're at because if you're giving kindergarten Coke, soda versus milk and shit like that, or even water, mm -hmm. and that's a fact <laughs> in Mexico. But that's not because they lack like them, information. Right? No, it's because but it's just, they lack it's, resources. No. Yeah. Well, so... So that's Don't what I'm judge saying. them. Like, Who's, what the heck? I'm not judging them. You just it, judge just them right now. Fact. <laughs> See, that's, that's the difference between um, the way I'm I look okay. at you and the way everybody else wants to look at you, right? Because, I mean, it, it, there's just, like I said, you know, I just want I just want to, like, overall stick to, like, fact shit. You know what I mean? Because if you, if you, if you look at it, right, um, if, if that were the case in some things, um, and, and I know that, you know, yes, I know I like fucking, you know, my motherfucking chicharron and all this fucking fucker uh -huh. shit. Ahí está. But <laughs> in Mexico, every, one, every third person has fucking, like, diabetes. Aquí también, fool. We're like the fucking that. baddest country in the so, world. It, it's like, <laughs> it, you know, it, that's not a fact, though. It's a you fact. Know? No, it is that we are the baddest country in the it's world. It's not a fact that fact. right now, there's we the one in three motherfuckers have in diabetes. What? One in three people... I just said it. You said that's diabetes. not a fact? Have diabetes, diabetes, diabetes or bad okay. meat? Okay, here. So, um, what is the fact? I would, like, I don't get it. Yeah, so we are the fattest country. What are you saying? We are the fattest country. We are the fattest country. Oh, he it's said that in another and, place, and, one in three people and, have diabetes, and, but not here. That's not true either. Go look. I'm, as a matter of fact, I'm going to pull up. Then who's the fattest? I'm going to pull up. It's a whole other different Mexico. We're not the fattest. We're not the fattest. Mexicans, that's what he's saying. No, I didn't say that. Well, not... So my like point saying, is, like one in three people, you know, but in the United diabetes. States. So I, I, that's what I, that's what I want to do. I want to spread. I want to like the whole thing of this is like, like for reals, like you know what I mean. Like if this is a fact, right? Like we have a <laughs> fucking virus and some shit's going down. Treat it as such because you could sit there and I could bring out you know my facts. You could bring out your facts on certain things, or the next person could bring out their facts, right? But if we don't fight this together correctly, ain't shit gonna happen. So We're just gonna job, continue Malcolm. going like this. <laughs> this is gonna happen. What We're about the positive it? things of COVID? How about the quarantine challenge? How about all the people the that are doing shit? Challenge? Yeah, there's a quarantine challenge. Yeah. There's um the rap quarantine challenge. What about all the all the all the hype and everything? Everybody's doing that. Like, and, and people taking care of their own kids. You know, like, like, as a matter and fact, people, let's, parents let's having to spend positive, time. The positive, parents having to spend time and, and learn about their kids. And right? Like, como chingan, como cagan, como lloran. No, but that's a positive. <laughs> no, for us. But a positive because of bonding. Yeah. 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 I got so, no kids, so I only got five what, kids. What, what, what positives then? What do you mean? I mean they said that one right no, no. People, that, people are getting you just creative. Randomly, people randomly people say are, like, are, oh, are right. not being materialistic, so we're understanding that material things do not matter. Okay. Um, you know what I mean? People are really understanding that, like, uh, staying in. People are not being so fake with, like, coming out and, like, going out to, to places to be, like, on live, to act like they're doing shit and all this and that. Put on TikTok, TikTok yeah, challenge. Like, <laughs> I live well, for the memes. You know what I mean? Like, so there's a couple of... of Inventando no, que pendejada there's, hacer there's en la casa pros. and shit. There's a lot of fucking We're just people saying, just making some dumbass challenges. Let's focus on the pros. We're not saying that the pros outweigh the cons. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Think like, about the pros. But let's talk cool. about those. Even if it is a couple of them, let's talk about them. Okay, talk about them. That's what I'm saying. He's not mad. He's okay, talk about them. No, I'm not, I'm not <laughs> mad. I, just, I do agree. Like, for example, like, there's probably people that have never taken care of their kids. Right, because they got the money, so they send them out to take care, and they do all this Even stuff. Even Cardi B said it. Right oh, now. <laughs> you, know? you know what I mean? They, they don't have that luxury, right? So, uh, yeah, of Ahora course. Se like you said, <laughs> that's a positive, right? Like, um, I think uh, what's more than just that is... The environment. Less driving, the environment, and climate. Oh, See, that's the true. gas prices are going down. Oh, hell yeah, they're fucking the going down like crazy. Down yeah. and shit. See, those that, that those are actual subjects, not just random things. <laughs> but it's not random you know, things. there's it's a lot guys. of positive things and shit. You know? Yeah, well, but I mean, continue talking about it. You guys can't. But we just don't be know like, everything. No, you know but we're just like for so example. So when you mention that, follow that you know up with mean? some shit. Make sure you check out your local <laughs> artists and stuff, and like they have a you lot know, of projects doing. You can't just doing. be like, oh, and there's positive. Okay. There's people doing music videos, and I'm saying the TikToks are fucking 
people are getting more creative on their challenges instead of pendejadas. Which I learned how to um, <laughs> do um, how to use like a software like to make lyric videos. Oh yeah, and I've never I've never like done anything like that before. So I'm like people's creativity, new skills. Or, you know, that's a positive. Now imagine you know? if we didn't have yeah. internet. Imagine if we didn't have internet, Wi-Fi, all that shit. What would we do? You know, so appreciate what you got right now. Kind of. <laughs> Kind of. <laughs> <laughs> kind of. Well, yeah, I think those are good things. And like, like um, well, somebody Wi-Fi, said Erica, porn, the whole um, a piece somebody, somebody, I don't know how real that shit was, but somebody posted up a picture of how LA used to live. <laughs> it's true, the yeah. less mugs, yeah, yeah, yeah. Less fucking, um, you know, swag wives and I shit like breathe. that, before and after. And I mean, like I said, they fucking Photoshop the fucking. It's magic. So, if if that were if that actual picture was true, I'm like, man, you know, it did make me think, like, oh fuck, what well, has to be, like, there has to be some reduction in smog. You know what I mean? And smog's fucked up, right? For those I know, Erica, you know, she talks about how. Um, He's always talking about how he knows what I'm saying or what I'm she thinking said or it. something. Can you let me say it or Go talk what? about it? I don't know. Exactly. But don't talk about it. I like, said, talk about I'm what you want to say so you and let say me it. have my own like opinion I when I want to like chime I in. Like I said. 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 That is not true. That we're making up this whole global Erica warming. Erica believes bullshit. that we're making up and this global gonna, warming. Wow. You didn't say that. I did not say that. What'd you say? I, no, I'm not even. She did not like, say that. Exactly. Seriously. She didn't say that. You I know. Uh, so I'm a my point is, I like to talk um, about what I believe. Some of that sometimes. stuff. I just like <laughs> how <laughs> overreaction. She can actually like. She talking about pack pedaling. There it is, right there. You know. Back pedaling. No. I have to say something in order to be able to back pedal. You did. I haven't even said anything. You did. We're like we're, we're like the meme, another pen the hell of the day. <laughs> we just so, hear money on me. <laughs> you know, those things are important, right? Like, um, if, if you do believe that, you know, our whole fucking thing and global warming and all this shit and things are less smog, I guess it's helping, right? Like um, environmentally wise, yeah, it is helping. You know, and, and let less people out in the fucking boats, fucking killing the fish or contaminating the fucking ocean. Like what do you guys think? Shit. What do you guys think of the homeless and all the shelters? Oh, what that do you guys part. think of that? Yeah. What do you guys think of uh, the people? I mean, it sucks some situations, you know what I mean. But uh, a lot of the um, people, like the shelters and everything, they're actually locking down. They're locking down now. Their doors. They're not taking door, yeah. people like the domestic. Though that's what I was like, damn, like the domestic violence, um, the women's shelters. They're actually closing the doors to like family and like women and children. Right and, now and, yeah, and, but you know what? In Orange stuff. County. I, you know, look it up, but in Orange County, from what I understand, but, you know, they got fed up. Um, they're actually trying to, like, help out. They got fed up, too? No, no, they got real <laughs> No, they got real fed up. He's saying the old He got fed up in L.A.'s, bro. Wow. You know? So, Damn. Um, wow. like, they actually are, like, <laughs> like I said, don't, you know, I'm, I, I can't give you, like, detailed facts, but the dude that, you know, running Orange County has... From what I understand, he's actually trying to get hotels to um, house some of the people. Because mm-hmm. even hotels are like, they're done, right? Like, who's going to a hotel? For what? What the fuck are you doing over there? So, from what I understand, they have at least 200 homeless people. I've been wanting to And the food hotel. banks, mm-hmm. the food banks are actually like uh, up by 700%. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Like, um, a lot of the sources that like, you know, people take for granted are just kind of like, you know, diminishing. Oh, stuff. so oh, like, what know. are you saying? So like, at the grocery stores, the people that the things that people are usually like buying just because they just they're are over being, they're, yeah they're they're being sent to the food banks. Some of them so the food banks are, say like you buy like say like one can of I don't know one can of soup or anything. Mm-hmm. Some stores I, can't, I don't know which stores, but I know some stores are actually giving it to the the food banks because the food banks are actually running out of sources too. But they, oh, I mean that they're there is. Running out of yeah, because yeah. uh, the people. Because you don't have it, right? Yeah. But they're keeping it, maybe. So, no, no, want. I'm talking about like uh, that. You know, the the sort the, the food banks are um trying to fucking give to people that then in need and everything. But our people in need has scaled up so seven hundred percent more. Yeah. You know that like uh, that, the struggle is real. You know what I mean? Like uh, crazy shit. You know what I mean? You don't think of things like that, right? Like how And don't be fighting that Walmart for toilet paper. You need that chingan and shit. Well, shit. <laughs> Taking that out of my cart and shit. Well, for real. 
Y que se le viera medio <coughs> corona en el culo y shit. <laughs> People be tripping with the hot toilet paper though. Yeah, that's come on. I don't know. You know I, mean? I didn't get it from John. I still don't get from it. Me, me I still don't get it right now. I still it's don't because, get it right now. It's because uh, like everybody's just trying to stay home and trying to like you know just kind of keep kind of like if you're keeping everything for a bomb shelter kind of thing, you know, keep all the resources all to themselves and everything, but. Todo mundo caga, ni modo que se vayan a correr con el papel de culo. Yeah, it's still But you know what, you know what, this is the only one, this is the only connection I found. Is that one of the symptoms is diarrhea. So you're fucked. That's what I thought too. I was like, oh, do you get diarrhea or something? But I mean, like, people have like, they use their clothes, they use leaves, you know what I mean? Like, the socks, you know what I'm saying? So I was like, Sock drink when you, I don't know about that one. No, I haven't I, done uh, it. Bro. I don't know. You gotta tell me about that one later because I don't know. It was but, the, 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 there was a, one of the homies got too pedo, but he had a cagar, so he had a cagar in the corner. So one of the homies said, you know how it's a joke? Oh, use a sock, but someone actually used the sock. He used, actually used it. He <laughs> came back sock. with one sock. Who look, see, look, he just said, people are out here playing soccer, practicing soccer. There you go, because it's not. They don't give a fuck. But, where, it's, where, where's the but it's because they don't uh, give a fuck uh, or it's because uh, it's not yeah, really just, that fucked up out there. Because in Mexico, there's only no, like but, but I'm just saying, I'm, we have we're thousands. just touching on based on that. Thank you. It's just like, that's what, the, it's still, if, if, I, I, back again, if it's real and this is going down the way it's going down, that's that's proof that our government in Mexico probably don't give a fuck because they're, they're already on their shit, like, Oh, yeah, let them motherfuckers keep practicing. Because well, we, we, we got the curanderos, that. that's one. Yeah, yeah. yeah. my grandma yeah. said my grandma <laughs> said that she was watching the, the El Presidente de Mexico, and that he was, like, talking to, to the gente, and he was like, Ay, ustedes no se preocupen. Ustedes abrácense y besense. <laughs> Y que andaba y que agarraba y que agarraba a una, a una niña he y tried, así, bust que agarraba a una niña y que la agarró a la niña así, yeah, right? Yeah. <laughs> sí. You know? But my grandma was like, este está bien loco, you know? Like, he's over here freaking hugging kids No, te metas con mi cucu. <laughs> They gave him a full shit for fucking, um, he passed by um, Chapo's uh, mom's, like, I don't know if her place or around her or where she was at. And she actually asked that fool, can I talk to that fool? And that fool came and shook her hand. And fucking everybody gave him shit for that. Just for shaking hands during this whole thing. Even people in Mexico. You know what I'm saying? So it's just like. I'm going to do the foot thing. Like, <laughs> what is That's it? That's what I'm thinking. But I'm like, I'm done with that one. Like, what? saludando así con el pie. No, I'm done with that. <laughs> and better than the elbow because that was like, how do you think elbow. that people are going to start. Like shaking hands now, now you know what I'm saying? Is he's los like los. por con el elbow, right? And I, I was like, yeah, probably. Like goes, a cholo. But think about it: when people cough side. now, they cough like this. They go. <laughs> so it's like, and then you're gonna go like that. Like it's like, wait, no, you know what? I'd What's rather do the content? ankle. I'd rather do the ankle. You know what I mean? Like because I of that. Like, that shit. La pesta. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't know. You know what I mean? But I think this shit's for real. Uh, not, not for real, like I said, like, hey, fucking. Cause Lions are going to be no. out if you guys don't. Yeah, <laughs> the, the I can't, Trump, I can't Trump is going to let lions out if you guys don't stay inside. Joe like, Exotic you know says, saying? listen like, here, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, I, I just. I, They're going to go carol on everybody. When, <laughs> when fools are, I've seen some fools from where some way out shit. Like, for real, it's like. Oh, have you guys seen the guy wow. with the with the 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 swimming the swimming noodles on his head? No. Six feet distancing. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? Like Those this? are the shit that I'm saying. I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about just like, it's like a wolf. you know, um, live video ended. Sure story. It's okay, you guys. You know, it's like um, <laughs> my <Mind your> business. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you know, like really, just like. Just watch out. I, I mean, especially for your family. That's yeah, something. just watch out. Take care because it is prone for older people, for babies and everything. Yeah. Es mejor prevenir que lamentar, you know, precautions and everything. And you dirty motherfuckers, wash your hands. I seen some fucking chinito picking his ass. You know, I think fucking, this, is, this you know? might be like teaching people to be like a little bit more sanitary, right? Yeah. Like, yeah. yeah. There's, There's some nasty like, motherfuckers yeah. there, 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 out there. There's so many things that are going to change. I'm telling you, like. 
People are uh, the whole. They I'm should serious, find the people whole... for fucking snot rocketing yeah. and shit oh. like that. Eh? Uh, well, like, oh, oh, shaking hands. I promise you, people are gonna have a whole nother handshake from now on. I don't know. It was it funny is. because at the <laughs> beginning of the freaking when they first started, like uh, I went to Reno in February. And um and I had this like meeting uh, with the like some people from like the state you know and it was all of these like white people right and I'm like they're all right there and they're like hey hi hi and I'm like I'm gonna walk in and I'm like I'm gonna shake their hand I know that nobody's shaking hands but like I'm gonna shake their hand you know and I'm like I, I was like I was like oh hi you know and I'm like shaking hands like oh hi you know like and for, they're like oh they're like. <laughs> Oh, you know, kind of like, like not really wanting to. And I was like, what the fuck was up with people? Like, why are people so uptight? And my homegirl was like, because of the coronavirus shit, bitch. And I was like, oh, oh, So what they're trying to say is that they don't wash their hands. I didn't even think about it. Which, I mean, it's true and everything, but oh, no, no, la gan de pedo like that. I mean, I don't know. It's just, it's, it's, I think it's a little too much. It's going to be like, oh, wait. Okay. Might as well. (laughs) You know what I mean? Like, (laughs) I don't know, you know, like. Um, I just think a lot of shit's gonna change. Don't be fucking hopefully scared. For the, hopefully for the better. And, and I hope they come up with something. Because some people are going, sooner or later, this is what I told Erica. See, you just gotta wait for somebody to to do some stupid shit. Or act a certain way. Or, or, or something. To just spark up another motherfucker. You know what I'm mean? saying? That's what it is, right? Like, um, I seen it in New York, too. Um, you you know obviously in public you know places like the buses and shit, you know, th- is is there gonna be really social distancing challenge? Like you're in a fucking bus. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So, um, they went on there and they were like, hey, anybody without a fucking mask, you better get the fuck out of here. Whoopie whoop, I don't know. And there was like four fools, right? Three of the motherfuckers got out cool. Hey, I ain't tripping. All right, let's go. And one motherfucker was like, fuck you, I'm not getting out and. And that's all it takes, right? They fuck that dude up. Uh, Next thing you know, it's like, I don't know. <laughs> whoop whoop. Whoop. So it's just like, <laughs> those are the, the, the things that, that's when I start. I don't have to put a too. Like, Erica, was, she was like, oh, this was coming in, going like, oh, I'm for revolution. <laughs> like, you know, so that's when you got to start thinking about shit. You know what I'm saying? Or people get But if they had a cure out. for H1N1, I'm pretty sure they're going to have something here. Because that's what happened with all the plagues, the swine flu and everything. All of a sudden, all of a sudden. But did really actually people take a note was actually going on inside? Like like the hoax of like, uh, what is it, Sandy Hook? That was a hoax. It was fake. I'm sorry, but it was fake. You know, people are going to fucking believe. And then, yeah, in a way, I could see I'm, I'm a, uh, what do you say? Uh, what was he say? Uh, some, uh, oh, it's a, it's a conspiracy, you know, oh, yeah. it's a conspiracy theorist, whatever, you know. To some extent, you know, we're some, watching about the some shit stuff. about that and everything. Sorry, you know what I mean? Like because they're hiding something, you know. It's cool. Let's be let's be precautious. Let's be clean. Let's be sanitary. You know what I mean? It's just because por si las flies, you know. So you por never si know because there's some nasty motherfuckers out there, and there is nasty motherfuckers out there. You know what I mean? So you know what I mean? Let's just you know. Hopefully everything's for the better. I actually really do hope there's a, a positive change and everything but have you guys also noticed that it's been raining it's been raining why because rain cleans the atmosphere and everything have you guys notice because it's springtime no because maybe you know, climate control, <laughs> the government's doing the climate it's springtime you know? it's raining season but it hasn't rained this much in in in, in that's so true. long and everything you know that's so true. a good thing is the drought the drought was real for a that's while another, you know so yeah. pick a tree and pee the drought is real. No, <laughs> it was not. But it's not no more. It's not as much no more. Why? Because there's, there's a lot of different little things, that, you know. Yeah. Like. Hey, boy, salud. No, I think there'll be some positive shit for sure, or hopefully some positive shit. That's also. You know, and of course it's gonna be negative shit regardless of what. You know what I mean? Like, there's always those negative Nancys. So up, it's man. like, mm-hmm. you know, with all that, you know what I'm saying, and and, and what's going on, like. You know what I mean? Just fucking respect your fucking neighbor shit that, you know what I'm saying, that we already should be doing, you know what I mean? Regardless yeah, of... some of the neighbors are in verga, fool, la verga. Just because of the corona, I'm not going to respect you, fool, la verga. <laughs> <laughs> See, this is why, right here. <laughs> nah, but, you know what I mean? You know you know what I mean, like, that's just all fun and game shit, you know what I mean? But it's always like, Just be precautious know? and keep clean and just, you know... Do, do, do what we gotta do, you know, to, to make this a less risk because we are the highest 
in the world. Our country is the highest, and it's over 400 and county or whatever, you know. But, I mean, the news just wants to tell you what they want to tell you to give the people the scare because people are scared, you know. That's what it is. It's just that's how, that's the easiest way to move a, a, a group of people to how you want them or even a person to how you want is by fear. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Just That's like, a, just like way to said, control. you know, like on, uh, was it, uh, a Bronx Tale, would you rather be loved or feared? Like that. Like that. Hey. Which one is it? Shit, I'd rather be feared. <laughs> You're lying, she's lying. I love to be feared. No, I'm <laughs> kidding. <laughs> <laughs> nah, but. Fierce and love, no. <laughs> anyway, Honey Jack, oh. Well, we want to thank you guys. Yes. You know, um, I hope you guys got something out of this motherfucker. You know what I mean? Like, again, we're not here to tell you what to do, what not to do. We're just How to live your bring, life. <laughs> we're trying to bring some awareness, you know? We're trying to just, like, hey, you know what I'm saying? Like, pay attention, you know what I mean? Because some motherfuckers don't know shit. Like, don't read shit, don't read nothing, 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 nothing. Just the internet, you know? No es que uno sea inútil or nothing. It's just like some people don't have the resources. Some people don't have the, the um, how do you put it? Um, they don't go out of the box, you know what I mean? Like, you know, just it's just the prevention. They're kind of like me. Like, how does that kind of affect me? It doesn't affect me. So. No, no, even, no, no, even like, just, you if know, you talk about, like, how It's not that it about, doesn't affect you. It's just that you don't overreact like other people. Like, ah, oh, let's go get a chingo of toilet paper because, fuck, you know? Yeah. You just, what is necessary, do what we gotta do and just, Keep calm because we'll look, figure it out when we get no there. No se paniquea la gente, you know? <laughs> yeah, panic ain't gonna do shit. Uh-uh. But fuck with shit more, you know? For real. So, you know what I mean? Like, with all that said and done, you know Especially what I mean? at Walmart. Like, <laughs> <laughs> chill out with the fucking hoarding. For real. Oh, please stop hoarding shit. Some like, lady, some lady was getting mad at me because I bought a big old thing for my cats and everything. Like, le chingo, le importa, verdad? Uh-huh. But she's all like, oh, you really coming out just to buy cat essentials? Well, no shit. What the fuck? Because you, well, you think my hoard- cat doesn't need nothing? I know. Because like, like, uh-huh. fuckers like you be hoarding food. So I don't got, you know what I mean? Like, I got to think of a cat. That's my cat. Shit. <laughs> you know, so don't hoard shit. Fucking like, be so respectful. Well, don't be out and fucking um, at Walmart doing food. some bullshit. You know what I mean? <laughs> like, come on, you know? Save that shit. Just know your shit. And remember, always, always, always fucking... Look it up. When someone tells you something, whether it's me, someone, you know what I mean, on the other Especially side, if it's him. your friend, <laughs> your mom, like, just for real, research that shit. You know, that chingen, don't overprice your toilet paper on <laughs> fucking, uh, what is it, uh, offer up? Because people fucking jacking up the prices on yeah, no, no, the toilet even paper. If Talk you're about that shit. Even if you're selling toilet paper right now and you never sold toilet paper in your life, you're disgusting. No, speaking about I'm gonna that, do it like at the party. I don't know how to put it. You're we'll disgusting. Do, but uh, I, was, I, I posted up on my, on my IG, Sage. There's a, a restaurant, Sage. Popular ass fucking restaurant here in Pasadena. They're like a vegan. It's vegan. It's all fucking natural shit, you know? Ice cream, all this shit, beer, all this, right? I walked up to that bitch and they were selling toilet paper. I was like, for real? Fucking like, do that at Mexico for Oh, Peso, that's the one man. that he took the picture of. <laughs> I took of. a picture and everything. Yeah, and like, they had it in a little, like, a little case. What no, the fuck? In a little case. Yeah, I see it. Yeah. You know? And I was like, damn. Bring your toilet paper. I came to the homegirls, brought my own wipes. You like, know what I mean? Like, for real. It was like, oh, <laughs> I'm being considerate. That's it. <laughs> So it's just, you know, yeah. let's not do that shit. You know what I'm saying? Let's like, I got white piece in there. You know what I mean? Fucking. No, I know, but I siempre traigo because oh, I always I'm carry them. Like, let's respect that no, shit. You know what I'm saying? Limpio, you know? It ain't something to take lightly. <laughs> it ain't something to fuck around with. And there's people actually dying up in this motherfucker. You know what I mean? So, um, just shout outs to our nurses and doctors that are in there taking care of the patients in there and shit. So yeah, high for demand, sure. especially for CNAs. No, yeah, so the people that's out there that's, like, <laughs> coming back and forth, like I was saying. Cause my daughter. There's yeah. doctors, like, our, like she just said, our daughter. My daughter, she works at a, at a retirement home. Those are things that I wanted to talk about, too, but yeah. we didn't get into, like, but, yeah. But even um, though, did you just touch a little base on what? Yeah, right she, t- she, she works at a retirement home, so. Um, so these are things like that, that, that real life things that we're dealing with. That's what I wanted to talk on, like things that we're dealing with and stuff like that. Like real life things that we're dealing with, aside from the sixth grader that's like going to school online or whatever. Um, we have like my grandma, she has um, cancer. 
Um, she's just going through um, her third um, fight, you know, with cancer. And um, she's going through chemo right now. And um, my daughter lives with her. And my daughter's 25. She'll be a, a quarter this this November. And um, well, she'll be a quarter. Though. And uh, she'll be a quarter this November. And uh, and uh, she works oh, at a retirement. <laughs> she works at a at a retirement home. And mad love to mad love to her. Mad love to her. Feliz, my feliz. <laughs> and <laughs> um, she works there. And and then she also rents a room at my grandma grandmother's house. And then she also has two young children she has a, a three-year-old he'll be four in august and a one-year-old will be two in october um but um and so those are both of those my grandmother and her children are both susceptible to it like yeah. you know what i mean so um she's dealing with um she's not going she's not seeing her children um during the week um while she's at work monday or her birth schedule not monday through friday but whatever it is um she's she the kids are away at her grand at her mother-in-law's house and in ontario and then um on her days off thursday and friday is when she has them but she's just locked in her room at my grandmother's house because then she doesn't want to you know go into my grandmother's main the main house because then my grandmother's susceptible to it because she's going through chemo yeah you know what i mean so it's like like a bunch of things like that that we're going through so even though we're like um another thing that we were talking about where it's like oh we're like getting close to family and stuff like that like there's some family that we can't get close to so like the nurse told my grandma that she can't have no visits like no visits so she she's usually traveling to mexico to see my deal who's deported out there or whatever but um she doesn't get no visits not even out there you know to go out there or nothing so there's a lot of real shit that's like going on well yeah, but, and then yeah. for those you know that we were earlier even that um another thing some person had brought up it was a governor that was like um you know for all you guys that are like hey because there was some reporter right a journalist i think that was like oh can we get um a count of how many people have died in the elderly homes and what their names were you know and um i like i felt like that too right like oh well, i want to know motherfucking person next to me right if it's real and that means my cousin got to be affected somehow i got like, 300 motherfuckers no right so in the u.s right because of this whole fucking privacy shit and the way we talk and like things that go down as far as our laws the governor said well i'm stuck in between do I give you a name? Do I give you a name and tell you, hey, check it out, you know, fucking, I'm just going to say, Erica fucking Munoz has fucking um, the coronavirus and she died on Sunday because of this and that. And then, so what's the journalist going to do? Put her fucking picture up on the front fucking page. Oh, another victim of the coronavirus. Like, what about their like, pub, you know, the, like their privacy? You know what I'm saying? Like, you and, and and like, um, unless the price is right. No, I'm just kidding. Are they doing that? No, no. He was saying because oh. a uh, journalist oh, asked them. Oh, you know, um, can we get that count or, oh. or people's names that like in in those elderly homes because they've been more. Oh, sorry, I wasn't paying attention at all. That's also. actually that's actually uh, uh, against uh, HIPAA. HIPAA is like the privacy of any um, unless it's uh, what do you call it uh, authorized. Yeah. author isn't so, paid for so so yeah, you know so up. the journalist was asking can we get that and he said well i'm stuck in between a person's privilege to like you know they're gonna mourn somebody it's private Obituary. you know l- let them you know do their thing versus let me tell you a journalist that you're gonna be thrilled to put the shit on the front page and do all this shit you know and i was like damn that's true you know what i mean so like we gotta s- steer away from all that bullshit like Fuck who is or who isn't. If it is or isn't, it is. We know that. You know what I'm saying? We don't need numbers. We don't need fucking counts. Like, I mean, of course, maybe a majority count and all this, but not specifically. In Pasadena, California, you know, fucking Flavio died today of coronavirus. Like, come on. You know what I mean? That's a little too far, right? You know? And I didn't think like that until I heard this guy talk about it. And I was like, well, damn, how will my family feel if I die from that shit? And they're trying to keep this shit on the low. You know what I'm saying? And this is why. Because as soon as they find out that I'm 
was I die from it, then all of a sudden she might have it. My son might have it. Who did my son get in contact with? Who did my other son get in contact with? Who did she talk to? Where did she go shop? So it's like, it brings up all this other drama, right? Yeah. So it's like, damn, I was like, oh, shit. That's true, you know? Yeah. And we're not even prepared. Yeah, because our nation was different. You know, we're not even prepared to even do that type of work. Because that's another type of work that people could do, right? Um, let me find out who's infected. Okay. Let me better. find out how many people sh- they talked to. And then let me see how many people the other person talked to. And we could go down the line, right? And it could be a million fucking people down the line. But we don't have that right now. We can't do that. So those are things that, like, I, I don't think we need to be worried about. Your you dog's something me, so. What the hell? <laughs> Sorry. Hip <laughs> so, off, full privacy. It, you know, it's just like, um, with all that said, you know what I mean? Like, let's think about that. You know what I'm saying? And then some of these elderly people that might need some groceries if they're your neighbors, you know what I mean? Go buy shit for them. Help them out. You know what I'm saying? For real, you know what I mean? If you see they're a more prone person, to get caught with the disease than... than you know, the younger people. Yeah, and if you see some of these homeless people, you know what I'm saying? Like, just me. This is just well, how I am, you know? You could sit there and you could do all that other shit and be like, oh my God, I don't want to talk to you, you know? But hey, you know, as long as you got your shit right and you're covered up and you're doing your shit, extend fucking help your hand. You know what I'm saying? Like, because regardless of what, they're just like you. And they don't have what you got. So, you know what I mean? No, you don't have to be rude. You don't got to be a dick. You don't got to be like, oh, my God, you got this. Mm-hmm. Like nah, like a good neighbor then or is there? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? So, it's just like with all those things said and done, like, you know, we appreciate you guys. Thanks for tuning in. Thank you. Thank you guys for having me. Yeah, um, yeah. Abby Casualty, follow her, subscribe to her YouTube channel. She's you on do. IG at, at LA Casualty 420. And um, it's hard to keep a little bit updated and stuff, but I, I'll, I'll be on there. <laughs> uh, yeah, so that's just a homegirl, you know what I'm saying? So it's like, check her out, you know what I mean? Like, support each other, you know what I'm saying? Yep. Don't be that motherfucker. Just don't, just don't be that extra motherfucker, you know what I mean? Like, extra. So help out, fucking love your neighbor, you know what I'm saying? Like, even if you Not fucking, too much, though. <laughs> <laughs> Unless he's super cute. All right. And I mean. She don't even got a fucking cute neighbor anyway. What fucking neighbor? Nah. There's nothing on that. But you know what I'm saying? You don't know. With all that shit. Quit. <laughs> <laughs> See how they turn this shit into a whole other thing? Oh, thanks for tuning in, you guys. <laughs> yeah. With all that said, peace. Two beans in the motherfucking pot. Two beans in the pot. Guys, you and your dog humping me and shit from the moment. I was right here.